What's up, y'all? What's up, Libra? Libra, 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 Libra. This is a message for you, honey doll. Sugar snaps. <laughs> What's up, Libra? Sun, moon, Venus, rising, and north node placements. This message is for you guys. Take only what resonates with you. Excuse me. And <laughs> leave the rest for somebody else out there. Libra. What's going on, Libra? I hope you're doing well, baby. Feeling good. Feeling inspired, loved, favored, blessed, motivated, uplifted. All that good ish. All right, Libra. All right, all right, all right. Okay. Something could be happening, Libra. It's a state of emergency. It's urgent. I'm feeling that. Or something is going to happen um, quick. Something could be happening sooner than you realize. Something could be happening, yeah, sooner than you think. I feel like this is something good, though. I feel like something is happening sooner than you think, but it's, it's, it's a good thing, Libra. It's something that you've been wanting for some of you. Like, hey, something that you've been wanting could be happening sooner than you expected or something like that. All right, Libra baby. Let's see what's going on. Give you guys some messages. See what's in the energy for y'all. See what's happening. See what's happening, Libra. See what's popping. All right, baby. Let's see, Libra. Libra, 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 Libra. Sun, moon, Venus, rising, and north node placements. Libra. Good things are coming, Libra, okay? Good things are coming. That's what I'm hearing. Some of you could be seeing, like, a lot of different signs and synchronicities. Some of you could be seeing, like, different memes on social media that's just been trying to program you, okay? You're trying to program your mind to really, you know, grasp the concept to really believe that good things are coming, Libra, okay? I'm hearing good things are coming. Some of you could be seeing angel number 222. Some of you could be seeing 333, 313, 818, 888. Some of y'all seeing numbers like that. But good things are coming, Libra. I'm hearing good things are coming. You look really good, too. You looking good, Libra. You out here looking fine as hell, okay? You looking good, Libra, okay? You showing up as somebody that's looking good. Um, some of you could have fire in your chart. Don't necessarily have to, but some of you, you do have fire placements in your chart. You could have Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius in your chart for some of you, okay? I am seeing that. Five of Swords reverse and the Five of Wands reverse. Somebody here could have been wanting to cause conflict for you, but that shit is backfiring, or they just going to stop because you're still at peace. Somebody realizes that no matter what they do, or no matter what type of energy they try to send to you, you still happy, you still comfortable, you still at peace, or some shit just keep backfiring, it keeps marrying back to up. They like, wow, okay. Okay, Libra, okay. <laughs> like somebody is like, wow, okay. It doesn't matter what I try to send to Libra, they still comfortable, they still at peace, they still chilling. Like somebody is annoyed by that. Like, what the fuck? Like, what is it gonna take to disturb your groove? What is it gonna take to cause you to be unhappy? You like, I don't know. I'm happy though. <laughs> we got the sun card here, the nine of cups. Yeah, you happy, you comfortable. You at peace. You feeling good. Feeling uplifted, feeling inspired. You know, motherfuckers is like, what is it going to take to break you, Libra? What is it going to take to make you unhappy? We have the tower in the reverse. We have the king of pentacles in the upright. And we have the knight of swords in the reverse. Okay, let's see what's going on, Libra. Some of you could be connected to earth signs. Some of you could be connected to a Leo. Somebody with strong earth or Leo in a chart. Ooh, there you go with the sun card. Again, the sun card came back out. It's like somebody else is going through it while you feeling happy. Somebody is having um, some sort of unfortunate events play out in their life. Somebody could be feeling like they got like a stream of bad luck. Some sort of bad karma is playing out in somebody's life. Um, yeah, that's the truth. Ace of Swords. 
Somebody here could also be burdened by the fact that you know the truth about a situation or that the truth about a situation is coming out, okay? Or all of the above. Either the truth about something is coming out or it has come out or you already know the truth and somebody here is burdened by that. Somebody here is like, yo, I fucked up. We fucked up. I fucked up. This is fucked up. We like this is this is a fucked up situation. Somebody here could be a Gemini, an Aries, an Aquarius, a Leo. Could be multiple people here that work together in a situation. But they like, yo, we fucked up. Because somebody here is watching you. And as they're watching you, they're, they're seeing that you're good. They're seeing that you're good. Like somebody here is what confirmation. Somebody is watching you and they're seeing that you're good. One of these people or multiple people here that know what was going on or that's involved in something is watching you reporting back to somebody like, yo, this person is good. It's like, what? Yeah, they good, man. What you mean they good? They good. The bitch at the gym right now, she good. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's something here going on like that. Like, somebody here is reporting back to people that you good, Libra. They watching you. They see that you good. They like, yo, but we we did this. We did that. I know. So what you mean she at the gym? Yo, she at the gym. What you mean? Like, somebody here like, yo, I'm telling you she at the gym. It's like, well, all right, well. Check tomorrow. Tomorrow come. What they doing? It look like they on a date. What? They on a date, man. It look like they on a date. They posted a picture of some food. Or they went to the movies, man. I saw, uh, like, what? Like, somebody here is reporting back to a group of people or some shit like that about what you doing, Libra. That you cool. That you cope aesthetic. That all is well. Yeah. Uh, Emperor in the reverse is like, nah, no fucking way, man. This emperor in the reverse is like, there's no way, okay? There's also an emperor in the reverse here that knows that you know something. They feel seen. They feel exposed. They know that you know something. Something here has been illuminated to you, Libra. With the moon reverse and the sun card here and the ace of swords, oh, yeah, you have been enlightened about some sort of truth here, okay? You've been enlightened about some sort of truth here. Somebody's restless about this because it's like... Who told you, Libra? Who told you? And it's like, God, you know, for some of y'all, y'all just very intuitive. So, you know, you get your, you get your downloads, you get your information, you get your confirmation from source. Okay. Somebody here's like, fuck, I'm going to be fucked up. Like somebody here's sick to their stomach about this shit. There's a king of wands in the reverse here that could be um, trying to manipulate the judicial system. Somebody here could have um, a lot of legal issues that's coming up. Okay. Somebody here could be a Gemini, a Virgo, Aries, Leo, Sag, a Pisces, an Aquarius. They could have that in their chart. Yeah, somebody here is like in the Ten of Swords for real. Somebody here is angry. They depressed. They like cursing. They arguing. This was a stupid idea, motherfucker. Why'd you do this? Or this, this, and that. You know, these people going through it, y'all. Oh, they going through it. Okay. These people going through it. Queen of Swords reversed. The King of Wands reversed. The Ten of Swords. These people sad. They burdened. They depressed. Okay. Somebody here is codependent. Libra. Somebody here wanting to hold on to something. Yeah, man. Somebody here wasn't expecting you to heal and have a new beginning. Somebody here wasn't expecting for you to um prosper. Okay. They wasn't expecting you to to get up. Okay. I'm hearing that you fell a couple times, Libra. But one thing about you, you never fucking lay there. Okay, you may have fallen a couple times, but you never fucking lay there. You always get your ass back up. Somebody was expecting for something to like really like tear you down, put you down so much to the point where you wasn't going to be able to pick yourself back up. You wasn't going to be able to get back up. But I'm hearing you keep getting up. It's like, yo, what the fuck? Like, what what is it going to take? Like somebody here feels like you like a motherfucking um, X-Men or some shit. Like, you of another world. Like, that's how somebody feel. Because it's to the point where it's like anybody would have, like, quit or gave up on themselves by now. Or took them themselves out. Like, somebody here just feels like you should be a goner by now. Like, this shit is insane. The fact that you just keep going. The fact that you just keep healing. You keep evolving. You keep getting up. You keep elevating. You keep being blessed. It's like somebody here could have even watched y'all run it back the fuck up. Libra, I told you a message. I gave y'all a message like that last month, I believe. Like somebody here has watched you run it up multiple times for some of y'all. Like 
you go from zero to 100 real quick. Somebody here could have watched you lose a lot or lose damn it everything and run it, the, run it the fuck up. You run it back up. Like somebody here has watched you heal yourself over and over and over again. And somebody here has also watched you run it back up from zero multiple times for some of y'all and you want to know why that's the case it's because you're an alchemist libra whoever i'm talking to you're an alchemist and when you are an alchemist death and rebirth is your second language baby it goes hand in hand you're not um a stranger to that shit when you are alchemist death and rebirth go hand in hand you're somebody that has died a million times in one lifetime you know what i'm saying those of you that get it get it this message definitely ain't for everybody take the parts that resonate leave the rest but when you are an alchemist, baby, that's your second language, death and rebirth. You keep reinventing yourself. You keep being restored. God keeps restoring you. This is your season of restoration. Somebody here just like, why don't we just leave Libra alone? Because this shit is taking more out of us than it ever will out of Libra. <laughs> like, somebody here feel like you a motherfucking, um, I told you, like an X-Men or you the motherfucking Terminator or some shit. Somebody here is like, yo, what the fuck? What kind of... What kind of battery Libra got in their back? Like, this this motherfucker ain't human. <laughs> like, that's how somebody feel about y'all. Somebody here stressed out. Somebody here trying to figure out how they can avoid some sort of jail time for some of y'all. Okay? Somebody here thinking about going to prison or somebody here could have got sentenced. Somebody here could be in prison. They could be nervous because they know they ain't going to get out. It's some shit going on here. We got the Nine of Wands reversed here. Eight of Swords. Somebody here could be a Scorpio. They could have Scorpio in their chart. Yeah, somebody here is really unhappy. Yep, as soon as I said Scorpio. As soon as I said Scorpio. Somebody here did y'all filthy, Libra. Justice in the reverse. But this person going down. This person going down. This person, they, they getting locked up. Somebody here trying to get their story together right now. And they still going to jail, man. It's a Scorpio. Or it's somebody with strong Scorpio placements. Could be a Leo as well. Or somebody with strong Leo placements. Somebody here going down. And when I tell you this person, they know it. Oh, they know it. This could be somebody in y'all family. Or this could be like a friend of your families or some shit like that. This could even be your child's father for some of you. Somebody here is going the fuck down, man. This person wants to apologize to you so bad. It's a water sign. It could definitely be a Scorpio. It could be a Leo. It could be a Cancer. It could be a Pisces. It could be a water sign here or a Leo, somebody with that in a chart. This person is trying to hurry up and come back towards you, trying to make peace with you. They thinking that maybe you could save their ass, save their life. But it's like, Libra, even if, you, even if you had it in your heart to help this person, something here is already exposed. Like something here has already been illuminated. Like they still, they still getting... They still getting the book thrown at them, man. Yeah, judgment in the reverse. It's like, even if this person came to you with a whole story, and even if you didn't believe this motherfucker, but you was like, all right, I'll help you. It, it does not matter at this point. Like, something's too late. We have the judgment in the reverse here. Judgment reverse, will of fortune reverse. It's too late. It's too late. And what's so crazy is that everybody that's connected to this person is suffering in some way. Um, this could be their close friends, their family. It's like they all suffering in some way or anybody that played a role in what this person has done to you or knew about it and didn't do shit. They all get in some sort of judgment. They all under judgment in some way for not speaking up, for not saying something like motherfuckers is getting their asses handed to them. I promise you. Mm. This person was thinking about coming towards you, expressing some sort of feelings to you. But they know that you know what they did. Yeah, they know that you're not feeling them. You wouldn't get what you need out of this person. This would be unrequited like it has been in the past. This is not somebody that would actually um, fulfill you in any way. Your cup would definitely be empty with this person. This person could be going through financial issues. For some of you, they're saying that they betrayed you or they did something to you for finances. Like it was all about money. They sorry. This person is losing a lot. They could be, if they was married or in a relationship, they're going through issues in their love life. They're going through issues in their home. They're going through issues with their family. They could be going through issues with their friends or anybody that they work together with to sabotage you or betray you in some way. This person could also be losing a job. Y'all hear that? I'm telling you, something going on with this person, man. I 
yo i'm i promise you like as soon as first of all as soon as we got in this bitch there were sirens that went off now we got like come on i'm telling you something going on man this person is like in a state of emergency i'm telling you it's something here that's going on with this person shit is back fine on this person this person could have been trying to cause conflict and chaos for you. This person could have just wanted people to randomly attack you or people to look at you in a very negative way. People to like, um, not like you and just, you know, do mean, nasty shit to you. Like somebody here could have did some sort of spell work or sent some sort of energy towards you to have people just dislike you or treat you unfairly and to cause issues for you or to want to fight you, to want to harm you, to want to hurt you. That shit backfiring. And it's backfiring in such a way where this person got problems with damn near everybody that they cross paths with. Yeah, this shit is crazy. Why would you even do that to somebody? Like, whoever this King of Cups in the reverse is, I don't wish ill on nobody. I really don't. I just be wanting people to heal so that they can make better choices. But it's like, whatever this person got coming to them, it's like, they really bought that shit on themselves. Because why are you out here wishing shit like that on somebody? What's wrong with you? Like, why the fuck would you want somebody to have issues with complete strangers for everybody to want to attack them or to... You, like, that's what somebody was wishing on y'all. For y'all to just be out in a world where everybody hates you or you just... It's just bad shit that just happened to you. Like, people just starting shit with you or random people just coming towards you, fighting you. Like, people... Like, whoever this person want, Whoever this person is, that's what they wanted for you, Libra. It didn't work. It backfired, thank God. Okay? But it's like, that's what they wanted. Somebody here wanted you to live in a... In a a state of fear or anxiety somebody here wanted you to always feel like your heart is beating out of your chest or something bad is going to happen or like you know the boogeyman right around the corner libra you know what i'm saying boogeyman right around the corner like somebody here wanted you yo it was quiet before i started this reading bro these sirens are a sign this shit is an omen it was quiet before i fucking did this reading Somebody here wanted you to have like panic attacks, anxiety attacks, to always be in a state of fear, to always be in a state of worry. This shit is over. This cycle closed out. This person is fucked up for this shit, Libra. Like, this shit is fucked up, okay? But it's all right, baby, because it's not going to, it didn't work. It hasn't worked. It's not going to work. Like, this shit is just going to fall back on this person. Whoever you are, you are high priestess. <laughs> Libra, you showed up as a high priestess. Like, why Why always playing with somebody that they know they shouldn't be playing with? Like, maybe somebody didn't really respect your handle. Somebody, confirmation. Somebody, listen. Somebody here did not, somebody here needs to drive safely as well. Drive carefully. If it's raining outside, it's slippery. It would be, I would advise you to not um drive, okay? Whoever this is. Not you, Libra, but this person that's, that's been doing this shit. Because it's like, it's up. It's up from here anything's a go at this point so this person may get into a car accident somebody here may try to like fight them they could be having issues with anybody in the street anybody that they cross paths with they having issues with them like i'm telling you it's up for this person they need to be very fucking careful they could be nervous too like this is somebody that could be living in a, a state of fear this person could be looking through their peephole looking out the window looking over their shoulder every five seconds this person is nervous because that's the energy they were sending to you and that shit got married the fuck back. Whoever you are, Libra, you a high priestess. You a high priestess. This person is going to want to come back around, man. This person is going to be wanting to come back around to try to um ease whatever's going on in their life. They they feel like if they come towards you, they could bring peace in, 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 to their life. Like, it, there could be some sort of peace or some sort of calmness, um... And they like, they like, yo, if I go towards Libra and I try to make things right, then that'll lessen up what's happening to me. Like, that's how somebody feel. But like I said, it's too late. Like, with the judgment in reverse, it's like, even if you had it in your heart to be like, okay, you idiot, I'll help you, you know? It's no help here for this person. Like, it's, God is not playing with this person. Like, this is the wrath of God on this person as this person even got like some sort of demonic forces that's um controlling them or around them or monitoring them like this person got a lot fucking going on here it's a lot of shit here that done came out libra trust me when i tell you it's a lot of shit here i wouldn't wish this on no fucking body that's why i said this person is dead ass wrong for even doing this shit like who the fuck thinks of shit like this who wishes shit like this on people like what is wrong with this person this shit is bad this shit is horrible i would yo this shit is horrible man but i'm telling you 
they feel like if they come towards you, get some sort of help or get some sort of forgiveness or calm a situation with you, it'll lessen a low. Is not, bro, is is not though. It's too somebody here did too much. You understand what I'm saying? Like, it's is no help in this situation, Libra. It's nothing that you can do about this for this person. Absolutely nothing. This is bad, yo. Like, I can't even make a joke about this. I can't. This is bad. You healing, Libra. You healing. You showing up as a healer. You showing up as a healer and a high priestess. You didn't deserve this shit, not even a little bit. You didn't deserve any of this, which is why it didn't work. God saved your life many times libra because somebody here kept doing something like they kept doing it over and over and over and over and over again that's why i said somebody here did too much there's no coming back from this because somebody here did it too much like maybe this person would have been able to be redeemed had they did it once or twice no somebody here did something too much they overdid it they overdid it libra you showing up as a healer and a high priestess and an earth angel that's how you showing up, Libra. You showing up as a high priestess, a healer, and an earth angel. This person is a fucking bully. This is a tyrant. This is somebody that wanted to stop at nothing. Okay? The goal is to destroy you, Libra. Take you clean out. There's no stopping. It's not, I'm not going to stop until Libra is, is, is gone or until Libra lose their mind. God said, all right. Go ahead. Cool. That's what you wish. That's what you continue to do. You go right ahead, sweetheart. This shit gonna be this shit is bad for this person. Somebody here could be a Capricorn, a Taurus, or a water sign or a Leo. When I tell you this motherfucker done fucked up, man. Whoever this is, they don't fuck they know they fucked up too. They know they did. This person know they fucked up. And what's so crazy is for some of y'all, somebody here going to jail in this energy. Could you just imagine being in this energy and you in jail? You know what type of people gonna be in jail around you? Just imagine that shit. Like Libra, let me let me just I got chills all over my body, dog. My whole body temperature just changed, man. Just imagine being in this kind of energy, but you around all types of criminals you know what i'm saying like people that really don't give a fuck you know what i mean like motherfuckers that may have life sentences that ain't got shit to lose you know what i'm saying like just imagine being around these kind of people and you under spiritual attack and you in spiritual jail and you don't have no protection and you and you experiencing backfires you experiencing spiritual warfare you in jail and you under spiritual attack you in jail and you got um this energy surrounding you where motherfuckers just want to start shit with you. Like, I just told you, Libra, somebody here wanted people to just attack you for no reason. This shit is going back to this person. And for many of y'all, this person going to be in jail when this shit is happening. Could you imagine all of these inmates just wanting to attack you just because? I mean, it's already like that, you know? But imagine that you being in that energy and being in jail. Like, that. this shit going to be... This shit is bad, bro. Like, I'm not even over-exaggerating. This is some of the worst fucking energy that I have ever channeled in my fucking life. And I've been reading for years now. I've been reading for years. I've been reading for, for years. This has got to be some of the most scariest fucking energy that I have ever channeled in my life. This shit is scary, okay? Like, this is bad. This is really fucking bad. Like, really, 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 really bad. May God be with this person. I, I just, I don't even know what to say. This is going to be... Why would you, why you did this? For money? Because that's what somebody said. Like, they did something for money. There's no fucking way that you did all of this for money. Like, this is, this is horrible, bro. 
this is so bad oh my god this is so bad this is so bad this is so bad this is so bad oh my god this is so bad like i feel like crying like because this is bad this person is not built for this shit at all nobody is Oh, this person's a thief. This is somebody that stole something from y'all. They tried to steal something from y'all. This person could be very depressed, very lonely. Okay. This person is not built for this shit. I promise you, whoever this is that was doing this shit to you, Libra, this person is not built for this shit. Why would you do this? Why you ruin your life like this? Why you do this? Why? Why why would you do this? Like what? What? Oh no. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. And whoever this person is, they got like a a baby mama or a girlfriend or a wife or somebody here. Oh. oh my god Libra everything good with you you sailing the calmer waters you being protected this entity cannot attach to you whatever the demonic forces this person was sending to you they have to respect you it's like your angels protect you and the demons respect you thank god for that because you would have been fucked up. Everything that this person was doing, oh, you would have been fucked up, Libra. Mm -hmm. Y'all would have been fucked up. Yep. Yeah, man. Y'all would have been fucked up, man. Y'all would have been fucked up. Somebody here was doing some heavy, this is some heavy shit. Y'all know I like to get on here and, and, and uh, fuck around with people and tell them, oh, you doing Fisher Price magic. You doing this, you doing that. You know how I am, Libra. No, this is some heavy shit that somebody was doing. And the way that this shit is mirroring back to somebody and then on top of that, they going to be in jail while this happened. For some of y'all, this person's going to jail and this shit is, this is the energy that they're in, that they're surrounded by. And you can't keep no lights on in jail. You can't keep no lights on. When, light, when it's time for the lights to go out, the lights is going out. Like you can't turn no light, you can't have no little night light on when you in jail. When they when they say lights out, lights is out. <laughs> this person gonna be hearing shit, seeing shit, and they gonna have motherfuckers that's in there attacking them. Like literally. Father God. Oh, Father God. Oh, Libra. I don't know, baby. Uh, whew, thank God you protected. Yeah, whoever this is, they in their south node. Of course they are. This is a karmic that's in a south node that was doing this shit. This, this, yo, this is bad, bro. This is so bad. Oh my God, this is bad, y'all. Oh, I wish I was, I wish I was over exaggerating. This is bad. This is so bad. Oh. This is bad, Libra. Whoever this person is, this is bad, man. Oh my God. Oh my God. You know what it is, Libra? It's because I have a heart. You feel me? It's like, even though this person clearly wanted all of this for you, and this is just their bad karma, right? It's just like, damn, like you still don't want to see somebody go through that. And it's like, well, they wanted that for me. That's what they get. And it's like, yeah, but I can't even say that. Like, I wouldn't wish this shit on nobody. 
Ooh, this shit got my heart like heavy. Wow. Like I was not expecting to channel no fucking energy like this today. First of all, look at this destruction. This person has destruction all around them. But this is what they wanted for you. They wanted you to be surrounded by destruction. This person's main goal. Yeah, they were. Oh, wow. They were sending this shit to your house. Okay. They were sending destruction to your house. They wanted you to have some sort of natural disaster for your home to fall apart. Confirmation. Yeah, this is a karmic of yours. This is not a soulmate. This is not a true love. This is not a twin of, I mean, well, obviously. But this is somebody here that wanted your home to fall apart. They wanted to cause destruction in your life. God said this person going to feel everything that you felt times 10. So Libra, some of y'all, even though you was protected from this, it didn't work. You felt what was going on. You knew what was going on. You could have been like, yo, what the fuck is really going on? Like, what is this? Because you showing up as a high priestess. So I know you know what was going on. You felt it. You probably was like, yo, who the fuck coming for me like this? Like, I don't even be bothering nobody. Like, Libra, you knew what was going on. You felt it, okay? God said this person going to feel everything that you felt tenfold. They going to feel the same shit you felt, but it's... It's going to be worse because it's act, they, they don't have any protection. Like, you have protection. This person don't have no protection. This same person could have also tried to do um, a love spell on y'all, which I think is crazy. You doing all of this, and then you're going to turn around and, and do a love spell, too? This person is out they fucking mind, man. This person was trying to block your destiny, block your purpose, block your path. Whoever you are, you're supposed to be a rising star, Libra. You a rising star. Somebody here wanted you to continue to work hard for you to be um, in poverty. Somebody here didn't want to accept the fact that you was an earth angel. They wanted to put an end to this. There's a high priestess in the reverse. There could be a practitioner here that's in your community or somebody that live close to you or somebody that live around you that don't fuck with your beliefs or they don't believe in earth angels or anybody that's of... Um, that's of the faith or that has strong a strong relationship with god or that's chosen or one of god's favorites and earth angels so on and so forth this person tries to attack confirmation this high priest is in a reverse getting it too yeah somebody here wants to steal from you somebody here thought oh they throw it and they throw it wrong the way this shit is backfiring on these people yeah this thief that's in a south node i cannot make it up thief and south node this thief that's in they south know about to get they asses handed to them. This motherfucker need to get a job, okay? This is somebody that may not even have a job. They may sit on their ass all day. Somebody here that's lazy, that's an opportunist, that wants somebody to take care of them. Mind you, this person has a horrible relationship with women. This is a, for some of y'all, I'm picking up on somebody else too. There's a masculine here. That has a horrible relationship with women. This person may hate women. Okay, they got childhood wounds and shit. They got issues with their mama that they need to heal from. This person could have been trying to do a love spell on you, Libra, because you single, you sexy, and you successful. That shit is not working. This is somebody that wants to be with you because they feel like you got a lot going for yourself. This is somebody that could have worked with a practitioner here. Yeah. This person is showing up as the Hierophant Reverse. Somebody here could be a Taurus. They could have Taurus in their chart. Somebody here could have also worked with a practitioner here to, to try to remove your protection. There's a practitioner here that was trying to remove your protection so that they could cause destruction in your life later. Somebody here knows that your foundation is protected. They also know that you're protected. But they was working really hard to remove your protection. Single, sexy, and successful minding your business got a good relationship with god and motherfuckers coming for you and they think this shit is going to they think this shit is actually going to work that it's going to actually happen they got the game fucked up somebody here sending you the evil eye they sending you the evil eye because they're a fucking loser that's why sending you the evil eye because they don't want you to have a real commitment they don't want you to have real love in your life 
somebody here don't want you to get some sort of money either. You got money coming to you. You got real love coming to you. All of that. It's like all your dreams. Anything that you could wish for is coming to you. Some of you got a new house as well. Okay. Yeah. You got a lot of stability here, Libra. Everything that's attached to you, everything that's connected to you is protected. Every single thing. Every single thing, baby. I promise you. It's all protected. Yeah. Yeah. Somebody here was obsessed with you. Obsessed with you. Obsessed with watching you. Obsessed with attacking you. Obsessed with trying to remove your protection. Obsessed with trying to block you from having some sort of money or having a, a commitment. This person needs to heal. I'm telling you. Somebody here is in a lot of emotional pain and they have animosity towards you. These motherfuckers need to heal. Like that's what they need to do. They need to fucking heal. Like what? What is the problem? Like these motherfuckers are lost. They're they're sad. This shit is ridiculous here. Okay. Somebody here want to make you a love offer so that they can steal something from you? Absolutely not. They're getting blocked. Or Libra, you already have this person blocked. Somebody here knows that you're a sweetheart. Okay, Libra, we have sweetheart here. Somebody here could feel like you about to travel with somebody. Or you about to live out a beautiful life with somebody. So they're working with a practitioner to try to block this. Yeah, somebody here is working with male and um, women practitioners. Okay? There's a high priestess in the reverse. There's a high in the reverse. A high priest in the reverse that's doing um, death, death magic. Somebody here could even... Somebody here is even planning to do something in the future. they like, oh, it's not going to work now, but it's going to work later. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> somebody here could even went a distance here to travel to somebody to do some death magic on you. Somebody here could be working with a practitioner overseas or at a distance from them to do something to you. Whoever you are, you're a prayer warrior. I told you, you're an earth angel. You're somebody of the faith. You have strong faith here. You have a strong connection to source. You have a strong connection to God. Nothing that they do is going to work. You somebody that loves yourself a lot. Some of you could be changing a lot about you in a good way. You could be looking better now or you feeling better because it's like you doing things that's healthy for you. Okay, so maybe somebody was sending you energy so that you could like do things that are bad for you. Okay, like be strung out on drugs or overeat or be lazy don't work out don't do this don't do that like somebody here wanted you to like just ruin yourself to just self-sabotage in any way that you possibly can but it's not working it's the, actually what's happening is the complete opposite so you could be eating extremely healthy you could be working out you could be making better choices here if if some of you libras was out here drinking maybe you have completely stopped drinking or you just drink occasionally um if you were smoking a lot you could have stopped smoking or you just not smoking as much like you are cutting back on things that are harmful for you or you just completely stopping altogether Somebody here wanted you to lower your vibration so that they can attach an entity to you. But whoever this person is, that's a um, practitioner, this high priest, this, this high priest in the reverse that keep coming out, this high in the reverse, this person has an entity on them. This is their bad karma. They can't even get rid of this shit. Like somebody here cannot even get rid of this shit. This is somebody that could be a false twin of yours. This person cannot even get rid of this shit. Like, they cannot get rid of it. There's no cleanse. There's no banish rituals. There's no nothing that this person can do to get this shit off of them. This entity, is it needs to be fed. It's feeding off of them. There's a practitioner out here that has an entity that's feeding off of them, bro. No bullshit. And people talking about this shit. People talking about this shit. Somebody here could have even been spreading rumors about y'all saying that you unbothered because you doing something to them. You not doing shit to them. This is God. <laughs> like, this is God whooping that ass. Somebody here that knows that whatever's going on with them, you not even capable of doing, Libra. <laughs> like, let's really talk about it. Whatever the fuck going on in these people's life, they know that your ass not even capable of doing this shit. They know that you have supernatural protection. No bullshit. 
somebody here cannot believe that you making all these positive changes in your life after all these rituals and shit that they did. Somebody here was trying to block your manifestations. The only thing that's happening, Libra, is your manifestations is coming in even quicker. And that was the first message that I had got when I first got in here, that good things are coming and something is happening sooner than you expected. Your manifestations is coming in faster than you may have expected them to. And somebody here is trying to block it. It's not working. It's not working. Motherfuckers is concerned now. Somebody here is concerned about jail. They're concerned about this entity. They're concerned about all this shit backfiring. They're concerned about you knowing the truth. They're concerned about your protection. They're concerned about the fact that you're really an earth angel. Somebody here is concerned about your finances as well, actual money. Motherfuckers is concerned about all the wrong shit. When they, what they need to be concerned about is their future. Like, this shit is bad, man. All of this looks very bad for them, not you, for them. Yeah, somebody here was doing voodoo. Look at this. A karmic feminine was doing voodoo. Somebody that's not held in high honor was doing voodoo. Somebody here was trying to cause you to be confused. Somebody here was doing confusion, spells, doing voodoo on y'all. And then on top of that, you still know the truth. That's why somebody is very confused about you, Libra. Somebody here may not believe in psychics or high priestess. Um, or very intuitive beings or earth angels like somebody here was like man please libra ain't shit like libra is none of that libra ain't nobody like this is gonna be easy somebody here realizes that you are who you are you are literally an earth angel you are literally a healer you are literally a high priestess somebody here is like what the fuck who is this like you told me that this person was nobody somebody here could even be having arguments with each other about this like you told me this person was nobody or you told me this person was just a regular person they're not a regular person like somebody here was trying to cause you to be confused about who was attacking you or where this shit was coming from this this and that you're not confused at all <laughs> like you're not confused at all this person is confused somebody here could be suffering from from scattered brain is what i just heard so one of these people now have scattered brain or something could be going on with somebody's eyesight as well oh my god oh my god yeah somebody here confused somebody here don't know what day of the week it is they don't know if they wash their ass or not somebody here cannot they it's like their memory is going what the fuck is going on here yo let me hurry up and get out of this fucking energy yo this shit is crazy <laughs> Oh my god, these people fucked up, y'all. These people fucked up. Somebody here has been attacking you since you was a child. Somebody here could have had like a um, Libra, hear me out. This is not for all y'all. But somebody here could have had like um monitoring spirits around you since you was a child because of your destiny. You've been under surveillance, you've been under attack since you was a child because of your purpose, because of your destiny. The attacks is not on you personally. It's on your assignment, baby. The attacks is not personal. And I know that that's a very, it's contradicting. It's like, what do you mean? Like, that doesn't even make sense, B. Just hear me out. It does make sense. The attacks is not on who you are or it's not really about you. It's about your assignment. It's about your divine assignment. It's about your purpose. It's about your mission. It's about what you're here to do. That's what the attack is on, okay? Anybody with this kind of purpose, this kind of destiny, this kind of mission, this kind of connection to source, this kind of power would be getting attacked. It's not about you, Libra. It's about your, your destiny, your purpose. It's about your mission. It's about your assignment, Somebody here going to jail. I told you. Ice King in the reverse. This King of Swords in the reverse. Whoever this is, this the motherfucker that's going to be under spiritual attack while they're in jail. This is the person that's going to be under spiritual attack while they're in jail. Ice King in the reverse and imprisonment. This person going to be crying every fucking night. Every night. This person going to be so fucking scared. This is the shit that I picked up on early. This person going to be so fucking scared. It's the fear that I'm picking up on that is out of this world. This person going to be shitting bricks every fucking day. This person going to be having auditory and visual hallucinations in jail, bro. This is bad, man. This shit got my heart like... Like this, this shit going to be, this shit, this person going to be like, boom, 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 Like they heart going to be pounding out they motherfucking chest. This shit going to be fucking bad. This shit is wicked, man. This is diabolical. This is some crazy ass energy, bro. Wow. Wow. 
Libra, some of you, your favorite color could be green. Okay? But you somebody, I'm telling you, this attack been on you since you was a child. It's your purpose. It's your destiny. It's your mission. It's your connection to source, to God, to the divine. It's your favor. It's the light that you carry. That's what the attack is on, baby. I don't even want to. I ain't even got nothing else to say. <laughs> like, I'm, I'm so done with this shit. This shit bad, y'all. <laughs> like, this, these motherfuckers should just left you alone. For real. I promise you. Like, just leave it alone, man. This is bad, y'all. This is so bad. Somebody here about to... Bro. Fuck hell on earth. This is a whole nother... This shit is a whole nother, like, situation. Like, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> like, this shit is a... The way you went through something, Libra, is not how somebody about to go through something. This person has no protection. The way... Yo. Yo. I, I can't even put this shit in words, bro. I can't even put it in words. Somebody is not themselves. Somebody has no control over their vessel. They don't know what they doing. Somebody here don't know what they doing. They don't know... They don't know who they are. They don't know what they doing. It, they have no control over themselves. This shit is very sad, bro. And very fucking scary. Um... This shit is crazy. It is no amount of money in this world that it's no amount of money, man. That's worth this shit. Like this shit is cr Yo, somebody here. Bro, this shit is oh my god, Libra. I I just I can't. I can't. I can't. I just can't. I I cannot like Oh my god. Yo, what? What? Yeah, this hierophant in the reverse. This motherfucker here. This priest in the reverse. This hierophant in the reverse. Whoever this is, this person is. They got something sucking on their brain. This motherfucker got like a parasitic infection. It's a spiritual. It's something spiritual. It's um. This person is sorry. They sorry. Somebody here could be a Gemini or a Taurus, or they got that any charge. Somebody sorry, Libra. Whether they going to say it to you or not, somebody in the spirit is saying that they're sorry. Or they will be saying that they're sorry once they start experiencing this shit for real, for real. Somebody here is like, I'm really sorry. Like, no bullshit, Libra. Somebody here is like, I'm sorry. I bet you are. Shit. This shit crazy. Yeah, somebody here has no peace. Rest and rejuvenate in the reverse. Somebody here not even sleeping. They can't even sleep. Somebody here cannot. Could be a Sagittarius. Somebody with Sagittarius in a jar. Oh my God. This person is going through it. Like somebody here going through it. You've accepted what this is, Libra. You've also accepted who you are. You accepted your path. You accepted your mission. Your calling. You staying focused right now. You remembering why you started. So you staying 10 toes down. You staying focused. You standing on your own too. You standing your ground. Somebody here is pissed off about this. It's a Sagittarius or a Capricorn. We got strong Sag and we got Capricorn both in the reverse. These motherfuckers is going through it. We got the Emperor in the reverse. These motherfuckers going through it. This Sagittarius, this Capricorn, this Leo, this Aries, this Aquarius, this Gemini, these motherfuckers is going through it. Whoever you are, you a star that they came for, baby. You keep showing up as a healer, as a star. You're literally a star. You're literally cosmic royalty. Like, you're of the cosmos. Yeah, Libra. There's nothing but stability surrounding you. There we go with this Hierophant in the reverse. This person could be praying right now, wanting to turn over a new leaf. This person could be wanting to do something nice for you or bring you some sort of justice because they scared. Somebody here getting a lot of bad news, shit just happening. People around this person could be passing away. I'm hearing people around this person passing away. 
somebody here could be seeing like a lot of bugs or some shit like that somebody here got like some sort of demonic force or demonic entity or demon that works with bugs that's around them so somebody here could be seeing like a lot of weird bugs and shit or they could be feeling like shit is crawling on them or something like that this shit yo let me get out of this shit yeah, somebody was trying to sacrifice y'all. They under judgment for this shit. Somebody here that's getting the wrath. <sighs> Bro, this is the wrath of God on somebody's ass because they tried to sacrifice you, Libra. Somebody here could be a cancer. They did this shit for money. I told you. This was about money, and this is crazy because it, I don't give a fuck how much money it is that somebody promised you or what you thought you was getting. There's no amount of money that is worth this shit. Like, this is some next level shit. Like, I cannot even put this into words what somebody is about to experience or what they are currently experiencing. I cannot even put this shit into words, bro. This shit is horrible. Yeah, the magician in the reverse here. Doing spell work, trying to sacrifice you and do all this shit to you, Libra, over some motherfucking coins. Everything working out in your favor. Will of Fortune. Cannot make it up, Libra. You right behind the Will of Fortune. Need I say more? You're good. You're solid. You're on the up and up. You didn't deserve this. Okay, there's a karmic feminine here that could be trying to go through a transformation or trying to heal. This person is praying a lot as well. There's an Aquarius that's scared. Somebody here got something in their house. Somebody here could be having some sort of um, supernatural disturbances in their home. This, this is bad. Yo, this shit, bro. I can't, I cannot. Oh, baby. Somebody here going to want to sleep outside. Somebody here going to want to put their whole fucking bed outside in the street. Somebody here is not going to want to be in their house. They not. They not, they, they not going to want to be home. They not going to want to be in their house. This shit horrible, bro. Horrible. Believe it, you good, though. This message was more so about what was happening or what's going on with these people. It wasn't so much about you, Libra. Your energy is good. Yeah, some of y'all seeing a lot of fives. Look at that. I said that earlier, didn't I? Okay. Yeah, 5121 on the clock. We got 555 five, five, and we got 55 five here. And we also have 1010. 10. This shit is over. This is over. It's over, Libra. Five, 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 and ten, ten. There's a positive shift that's happening, positive changes. This cycle is over. Okay, two, seven, one, three. We're going to read these angel numbers, okay? I'm going to get y'all one more. Spare, let me get one more angel number for Libra. Can I have one more angel number for Libra? Seven, seventeen. All right, baby. Yeah, you very brave. These motherfuckers, they don't have the kind of bravery you have. They don't have the type of protection you have either. You very brave, Libra. You're a very brave person, man. You very brave. You very brave, Libra. Very, very brave. This shit was so fucking unfair and, and so diabolical, so crazy. Like, Libra, you didn't deserve this shit at all. Like, not at all. Not not even a, a little bit, bro. Not even a little bit. Um, Nobody deserved this kind of shit. This shit is crazy. That's why I'm about to fucking cry for these people. I feel bad for them, too. And it's like, yeah, y'all was doing that to me, but shit, I feel bad for y'all. This shit gonna be bad. When I tell you this shit gonna be bad, Libra, these people, somebody here ain't even gonna wanna be here no more. Somebody here could be having uh, suicidal thoughts. They ain't even gonna wanna be here. Who the fuck wanna live that type of shit out? Like, who the fuck wanna live that type of shit out, man? Don't nobody wanna, don't nobody wanna live that kind of shit out. Somebody here may actually be wanting to take themselves out. is crazy all right libra so we got five 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 all right somebody here could be born in 87 or 78 all right but we got five 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 it says change changes are soaring your way the universe is going to be sweeping you up in forward momentum so don't fight it lean in be a driving force in your own growth and transformation think of this as a call for action on your part Keep an open mind and allow yourself to explore any new opportunities or possibilities that may cross your path. Embrace perseverance and spontaneity. While this is a future-minded number, it's still important to make your choices from a place of peace and stability. Be brave. Shit. Well, be brave, Libra. We see you got that. Bravery. <laughs> we see you got that. Okay? All this shit these motherfuckers was doing. We see you got that. You gonna tell these motherfuckers stay strong the same way you had to. 
Okay, we got 55. It says, take a deep breath. This one is all about change. Big shifts are on the horizon and your angels want you to embrace it. Change can be a bit jarring. It may not be easy, but it sure as heck won't be boring. You can't always predict how things will turn out, but you can stay flexible. Standing still will get you nowhere. Step forward with confidence. Okay, so changes, new beginnings, and major shifts are coming, Libra. Motivation and renewed sense of focus. Okay, you being versatile and you enjoying the present moments. All right, take a deep breath before making a leap, Libra. Your affirmation is, I let go of all excuses for not improving my life. Yeah, you on the journey of self-improvement. You making better choices for yourself, Libra. Your affirmation says, I let go of all excuses for not improving my life. It's time for you to improve your life, Libra. You are improving your life, okay? Some of y'all, you love butterflies, or you could be seeing butterflies, or maybe you have like a butterfly tattoo. Some of you could also be having dreams about butterflies or something like that. But Libra, I'm hearing that you are now a butterfly. You're no longer a caterpillar. You're no longer in a cocoon. You've gained your wings. You are a butterfly, baby. Okay, we got 1010. It says faith. Support is always there for you from your loved ones and from the very universe itself. When you feel overwhelmed or mirrored in negativity, this number may make its way to you. Let this gentle reminder sink in. You have the tools you need to see it through. Your comfort zone will always be there when you need it, but you should step outside it more often. Growth requires movement and bravery. Remember, you are safe and supported. All right, you are safe and supported, Libra. Yes, you are. All right, we got 2713. 2713, where's this at? All right, it says take, well, this says mindfulness. I like this card. I like the colors in this card. But it says mindfulness. This is a time to truly focus on staying present and being mindful. Notice everything that's working out for you and find ways to change anything that is not working for you. It's up to you to create a sturdy foundation to build that dream life upon. Your natural talents will be extra helpful with this reflective practice. All right. It's time for you to take stock of current situations, express your truest self, prepare for a solid future and stay present. Your affirmation says, I am deeply focused on forward progress. Okay, Libra? I am deeply focused on forward progress. Yes. And then you got 717. 717, Libra. All right. It says bravery. Have you been questioning whether you're headed in the right direction? If you're following your intuition, the universe answer to that is an is a yes okay you will never be sent something you don't have the capacity to handle those challenges you never know until you get to the other side exactly what they were guiding you towards face down your fears with trust in your heart yeah libra i feel like that's something that you have done you know how to do that you know what i'm saying you know how to do that baby it's, it's pretty clear whoever this message was for <laughs> oh you definitely know how to do that okay because motherfuckers was just this shit is crazy. Like, somebody here really played. And they just knew for a fact that you was going, you, you, like, who the fuck was going to survive this shit? Like, that's how somebody fell. Like, this shit is a miracle that you survived this. Okay? This is a, that's what I'm going to title this shit. This shit is a whole miracle in itself that you survived this, Libra. But I feel like your whole life is a miracle. Whoever resonates with this message that's a part of my soul tribe, your whole life is a fucking miracle. Let's really talk about it. Some of y'all resonate with the eagle spirit, okay? Something significant about the eagle. We got the eagle right here. You know what I'm saying? I represent the eagle too. What's up, soul tribe? Y'all got the eagle coming out. Some of y'all could be a life path number nine, all right? Some of y'all could be born October 9th. Some of you could be born October 5th. I'm hearing that nine and five are your lucky numbers. Nine, 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 five, five, five. Okay, some of y'all seeing 11, 11. Some of y'all born September 29th. Okay, some of y'all born October 2nd. Okay, some of y'all seeing 222 555 999 1111. All right, and we got those fives right here. Yep, 
That's what you're seeing, Libra. But you are an angel. I told you, you're an angel. You're an earth angel. Okay, but you also have angels that are supporting you. It says your angels are guiding and protecting you on your spiritual journey. What I told you, I said the angels project, uh, the angels project. I told you that the angels protect you and the demons respect you. Did I not say that? Yes, Libra, your angels are guiding and protecting you on your spiritual journey. And you are an earth angel as well. All right, you're going through big transformations, Libra, big changes. You are a generational curse breaker, and that is a big fucking purpose. That's a big mission. That's a big task. You got big shoes to fill, Libra. You got a big mission, a big plan. God got a big plan for you. You breaking chains, baby. You a generational curse breaker. It says reach out for the power and strength to make changes, enrich your life, and become the person you want to be. Libra, I feel like that's exactly what you're doing. You're becoming the person that you want to be. You're not afraid to get rid of your old life. You ready for for a new life, Libra. You transform it, man. This is beautiful. Yes, we got the eagle right here. It says you will soar towards your destiny with greater clarity and strength. Yes, you have clarity. You have strength, Libra. That strength card, that sun card that we kept seeing. Some of y'all could have Leo in your chart. Okay, something significant about Leo energy. You could have a lion spirit that's around you. You definitely have bird spirits that are around you. You have an eagle that's around you. You have owls that are around you. You are a winged seer. Libra, you are a winged seer you're someone that's very powerful you see beyond the veil but you are soaring towards your destiny libra and you got the strength and the clarity that you need you got the wisdom the bravery the courage to do so yes you are a star baby you are a healer okay angel star yes that's what you are the hard times are over libra 10 10 your faith is what got you through this libra your faith is unwavering it's so strong you so powerful man your faith is unfucking wavering. You making non-believers believers in this bitch, okay? But your hard times are over. Look forward to an abundance of happiness, enthusiasm, and positivity, Libra. Yes. 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 We did it, Libra. We did it. We did it. Shout outs to the life path number nines out there. Life path number one, life path number five, life path number two, life path number seven. Shout outs to y'all. Somebody here could be born October 13th, October 9th, October 4th, October 10th, October 5th. Yeah, man. You did it, Libra. You did it. Something about September 13th. One of your ops' birthdays could be September 13th. Somebody here could be born in 72 as well or 79. Somebody here could be born in 92 or 93. Somebody here could be born in 95. Somebody here could be 59 years old as well. Libra, you did it, baby. I'm so proud of you. I'm so proud of us. Keep going, Libra. All of this shit is supposed to happen. You want to know why? Because it's preparing you for your destination. It's preparing you for your purpose. It's preparing you for your assignments that's to come. Everything that you experience, and even if it's unfair, is preparation. It's preparing you for who you meant to be, who you are, who you remembering that you are on a soul level. This is all tied in. It's all preparation. It's all a necessity. Is it unfair? Yes. Is it hard? Extremely. But is it? Is, are you going to get through it? Yes. Is it preparing you? Yes. You're a fighter. You're a warrior. Keep going, Libra. God is so proud of you. Your angels, your ancestors are so proud of you. I'm so proud of us. Libra, I love you. Continue to run it the fuck up. I love you, Libra. Peace.